Using music can be a great way to help with learning a language. In this video, we are going to look at both why music can help with language learning and also how to use music for language learning. So first, why does music help with language learning? Music is fun, and most people really enjoy listening to music in a wide variety of genres, and we all have our favorite singers and artists and groups that we enjoy listening to. So why not take that love of music and something that we enjoy already and turn it into a language learning tool? Music makes things easier to memorize. The tunes kind of stick in our heads and we find ourselves getting lost in a song or being stuck singing a song over and over again. Well, that's kind of a good thing for language learning. So if there is a song that you're listening to in your target language and it gets stuck in your head, guess what's also gonna get stuck in your head? All that vocabulary, all those phrases and sentences and ways of putting words together in context, that's all gonna get stuck in your head as well. And that can prove really effective for helping you with memorizing those things. In addition, music is usually written in a little more casual way. It's not the more stiff, formal, polite way of speaking that we're taught in textbooks. It's a little more everyday speech and words that are used on a day-to-day -day basis by native speakers. So learning those words can be really beneficial. And why not learn them in a fun, enjoyable way from a song that you absolutely love? Music can also help you to get better and correct pronunciation in your target language because if you're singing along to an artist's song in that language then you're going to over time develop that muscle memory in your mouth for these words that maybe you're not used to saying and over time it gets easier and easier and easier to say those words and then that will translate over into conversation where you are able to say those words and say them more correctly because you've been practicing them in song. And this way of practicing pronunciation, this way of memorization and all these different things that we've kind of discussed is, if you think about it, a lot of the ways that we learned words and learned memorizing facts and different information in our childhood, we would be taught different songs. And those songs would help us to retain information in the language. So music and language are really just so linked together because music is a language in and of itself. And when you practice learning a target language by using music, you're going to see some really great benefits of that. It's going to stick with you easier and it's not going to feel like such a chore to learn it because it's music and it's fun and you're enjoying it. Another nice thing about learning a language through music is that you can do it anywhere. You can always have that song in your head. You can always turn a song on on your laptop or on your phone and listen to those lyrics and sing along with them. You can take music pretty much with you anywhere, whether on a device or just in your head. It's going to be there with you and you can always practice and have fun while you're practicing. So now that we know the link between language and music and how music and why music can make it so much easier to learn vocabulary and words in a target language, let's look at some ways that you can go about actually putting that into practice. How can you methodically use music to help you learn a language? One of the first things you can do is to create a playlist in your target language and you can use things like Spotify, Apple Music, YouTube, anything that you can to create music playlists in your target language. And sometimes you can even find these online. If you Google your target language beginner playlist or something along those lines, sometimes you'll come up with results for that. I happened to see a playlist the other day that was listed that was for introduction to German playlist. And it was a music playlist that was centered around learning German at a beginner level. So you can even put in your level and look for music playlists that people have already put together and use those to help you learn your target language. Once you have a playlist of songs or you have found a few songs that you really like and you would be happy to listen to over and over again, then go ahead and do a search for the lyrics for those songs and either copy those lyrics or print them out 
so that you can use them to refer to. If you're just getting started in this, maybe try to find some songs that have a fair amount of vocabulary words that you already know combined with some that you don't so that you can feel that progress coming a little bit quicker and it doesn't feel quite so overwhelming because you already understand certain aspects of the song and then you can start slowly building in that extra vocabulary. Then take some time and read through those lyrics and circle or mark any vocabulary, sentence structures or phrases that you don't know so that you can look those up and become familiar with how to use them. Once you have identified everything that you do not yet know in that song, then you can research, use dictionaries, look up grammar, or even ask native speakers to help you out with the meanings of those things that you don't understand. For example, you can use such platforms as Hi Native, Hello Talk, or Tandem in order to connect with native speakers of that language or with speakers who have a more advanced level than you in that language and ask them questions that then they can help you answer and figure out exactly what the nuances of meanings are in those songs. Because sometimes in music, it can be a little difficult to understand. You may figure out all the vocabulary words, but then you don't understand the full meaning of what's trying to be said. And that's where a native speaker or someone with advanced skills in that language can really come in and help you out to understand all the subtleties that's in that song. And that will just advance your skills even more because not only are you learning the words themselves and the grammar of it and all of that, you're also learning it at a deeper level that can help you as you pro are progressing in the language to pick up on those nuances of the language. And finally, after you've done all of these steps and you have a clear understanding of all the words and phrases and sentence structures in that song and the true meaning of the song itself, make sure in addition to that, you are also singing along. You really need to make sure you don't leave out this step. I'm pretty sure it's something you would do anyway, but do indeed make sure you are singing along with the song because this will help your mouth with forming all these new words you're learning and be able to say them quickly and smoothly. So music is really a powerful tool that you can use for language learning and I hope this video showed you a little bit of why that is and also how you can go about using music to advance your language learning skills. Thank you for spending this time with me. I appreciate you all so very much and remember to keep following your dreams and believing in the magic of this thing called life. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you again soon.